Uh, today I'm gonna tell you what you should do to put the eggs in a uh, incubator. So before, before um, you should collect first of all eggs and uh, you need fertilized eggs for sure. That means that you should take the eggs which are from hens uh, who are living together with a rooster. So taking uh, the fertilized eggs and if um, you cannot collect as, as much as you need straight away, you can collect it for several days, um, but not more than 10. So you can collect uh, eggs for the 10 days and you should keep them in uh, temperature from 15 to, to 20 degrees Celsius. Uh, before putting uh, eggs not a little pool. Uh, before putting eggs in the incubator you need to wash them uh, from um, all this uh, chicken uh, manure and all uh, microbes or any, anything so before doing that uh, you need to wash, wash the eggs uh, to do that you just pour, pour some drops of, of permanganate in water, wait until it digests so the water is, is pink, and you just take the like this um, cotton cloth and uh, wash the eggs. You can do it like this. If you have weak incubator like we do, and you have uh, several batches of uh, eggs, uh, to make it easier for you, you should mark every uh, batch. So like taking the egg and just taking a marker like on the um, bottom the number like for example number one that will be the first batch and you do it to all eggs then you should um, put uh, all this information in the, this let's call it like incubation journal you can put it in the journal uh, the date when you put the eggs in the incubator, the number of the ba uh, batch and also how many eggs you had uh, in that. Uh, so after you wrote down the name, uh, the number of the, ba uh, of the batch, you wrote down all information in the journal, you should clean the eggs in the water with permanganate to put the cloth in and wash the egg of all this chicken manure and all the insects it could um, not insects but infections you know so the egg should be clean you do it to all eggs write first number and then clean the egg because on uh, if you will clean the egg first you won't be able to write the number with a marker afterwards so you should clean every single egg and then when it's done, you can put them in the incubator, like that. Uh, always remember that for the incubation, we take in uh, only the best eggs. You shouldn't take, of course, eggs with cracks. No, for for sure not. You don't take too big or too small eggs. Uh, all the eggs should be similar color for closets, like white with with uh, dots. Um, Today we're putting the new batch in an incubator, so that's what I do right now. So remember, see new batch number one, when you put the egg in an incubator you put it with a sharp end down, obligatory. So um, please remember that incubation for the quail eggs 
takes 17 days. So guys, I wish you good luck with um, coal incubation. Thank you so much for the attention. Thank you for watching. Please sign up for our channel to not to miss the latest videos and don't forget to press likes.